Hey, this is Crystal with the Abundantly Blessed Homestead, where we use the wisdom of our ancestors to make amazing, nourishing, delicious food for our family. Today, we're going to go over my $1,000 Azure haul. I'm going to show you guys everything I got, why I got it, um, and we're going to go over all of that. But first, I'm dressed up because it is so cold here. Um, so anyway, you have to excuse the scarf and multi-layers. It just is what it is. Um, so anyway, uh, if you've never ordered from Azure Standard, I'm going to go ahead and put a link down below. If you use that link to set up an account with Azure Standard, um, you will greatly bless my family. So I will leave the link down below. Please consider ordering from Azure Standard and using my link. The other thing I wanted to mention is every week on Tuesday night at 5.15 Central Time, uh, PM in the evening, we make dinner together. We make an amazing, easy, nourishing meal that's kid approved every Tuesday night, and I show you step by step how to make it. If that's something you'll be interested in, please go ahead and subscribe to the channel. All right, enough of the announcements and talk. Let's get to the thousand dollars of Azure product. Okay, so just like last month, I ordered the same amount of um, animal feed. If you guys have not ordered, Organic animal feed from Azure Standard, please check it out. They sell whole grains, which is what I use um, to make my own chicken feed. Man, it's cold out here. To make my own chicken feed, uh, both for meat birds and for egg layers. If you need the recipes, they are here on the channel. Feel free to scroll through and it's all available for free right here on the channel. Um, and so I use a lot of whole grains for that. I'm gonna go ahead and turn the camera around so you can see. Okay, as I was saying before we got interrupted, um, this is all animal feed. All bags of it is it will be a variety of chicken wheat, field peas, barley, um, that sort of thing are all these bags, which equates to quite a bit of money. Um, but that is for our egg layers and our meat geese that we currently have right now. Um, also down here on the bottom, which I am not going to unload right now because it's underneath all of this, um, is a bag of, um, that was a soft white wheat. I got a 25 pound bag of soft white wheat berries to grind and make into things um, with my sourdough. So that is what the inside of my car looks like outside right now. <laughs> I am freezing, so let's head inside and see the rest of the $1,000 order. Okay, we are inside, but I am still bundled. I am not taking this off until I thaw out. So um, let's go ahead and go through the order, okay? So this is what is remaining of the $1,000 Azure haul um, that's left here. So one of the things I mentioned before, we ordered them again, is a 10 pound box of California Regions from Azure Standard. Um, you can get these in a smaller size. You can buy them in a five pound box uh, or a bag. But um, in order to get the moistest raisins from Azure Standard, please just go ahead and buy the 10 pound box. Um, the reason why is because this comes directly from the manufacturer. And so it is not repackaged by Azure. And so the uh, raisins are super, super, super moist, you guys. They are so delicious. So we always get a 10 pound box, even if it lasts us more than one month, because the moisture content in these is absolutely delicious, okay? So that's the raisins. I ordered, ooh, I ordered a whole flat, which is six, of the Nancy sour cream. This is really, really good for pretty much anything, you guys. Um, you can use it on tacos, um, I use it as part of my cheesecake whip. If you're looking for that recipe, it's a healthy uh, cheesecake whip that's on the channel as well. Okay, so I ordered six of these. Then I ordered something new. I'm going to unbox it on right on camera, so hopefully it's in good condition. <laughs> I ordered some pears. They were running low on apples, and I've never ordered pears from them. Okay, so they are individually wrapped in the box for freshness, I would imagine. Okay, whoops. And they are fresh. Look at that, you guys. They are ripe and ready to roll. So each one of the pears are, <laughs> are wrapped so that if one of them goes bad, then there, it won't spread to the rest. Okay, so this is an entire box. I think this was 35 pounds, if I remember right. Uh, 20 pounds. 20 pounds of their organic pears. They smell so good. You almost done? Yeah, <laughs> she keeps moving the camera. You guys are going to get seasick. Okay, so that was 20 pounds of pears. And again, the reason why I went that way is because they were all out of apples in the case. So 20 pounds of pears, and then they look like they're in really good shape. I didn't smell any disgusting rottenness or anything. So that's 20 pounds of pears. Oh, I guess I got two flats of sour cream, you guys. <laughs> uh, 
the channel, we're going to be doing a lot of Mexican meals coming up, so that's where all the sour cream is going to be going. Um, let me see about the expiration date, just out of curiosity, because I know some people will want to know that. Okay, expiration date. Uh, the end of March, so they'll last a good month, because it is still February. So, there's that. Now we're going to go ahead and let's see. We'll go here. I got a huge bag of carrots. You guys know that I buy a huge bag of carrots almost every month. They're great for making soups. They're great for snacks. They're great at roasted inside the oven. In fact, this Tuesday night's cooking class, we're going to be making roasted carrots and potatoes with a really special seasoning on them. Um, so anyway, I ordered a huge bag of carrots. These also freeze really well. So if you chop them up and freeze them, they'll be ready for soups um, or any sort of um, heated dish that you could use carrots in. Carrot cakes, that sort of thing. So that is a... 25 pound bag. Also down here on the floor, 50 pounds of potatoes. Now I've said this a lot, you guys, that now is the time, um, you know, starting back in January, I started saying now is the time to buy 50 pounds of potatoes because you can not only eat them, but they will start to sprout and you can plant them in your garden. They are much, much cheaper than organic seed potatoes and they're delivered in your Azure order. Okay, so that was 10 five pound bags of potatoes that came just all wrapped together. Um, and obviously if you buy that much, you get a discount um, as you buy. So let's go ahead and go on over here and see what's in these boxes. Care parchment baking paper. The If You Care brand is a healthier option to the bleach stuff you buy in the store. If you've watched any of my other hauls, they also make cupcake liners that are If You Care um, brand. They are not bleached at all um, and they're healthy for you. So I ordered some um, parchment baking paper, paper. This is 70 square feet. So the next thing in the box are onions and I order these every single month. These are organic onions, and they keep extremely well, sometimes even up to two months without starting to show rottenness or softness. They are amazing onions. I order them every month. This is a 10-pound bag. Oh, yeah. So this um, is not labeled at all, but those in the um, stockpiling community, I'll say it that way, the, the getting prepared community, Know what these are. These are oxygen absorbers. Azure Standard does sell oxygen absor absorbers along with Mylar bags, you guys, um, and several other things for storing long-term food storage with grains, etc. So I forget how many is in this package, but it's, it's a big, heavy one. But those are the oxygen absorbers, okay? Next thing in this box are nutritional yeast flakes. Um, if you read through the definition, um, the description on Azure, it does talk about in there how it is grown and has grown a lot um, safer than most nutritional yeast. I use this to make my dairy-free um, nach nacho sauce, cheese sauce. It doesn't have any cheese in it, but it has nutritional yeast, and that video is also up here on the channel. Okay, so nutritional yeast was something I purchased. I didn't remember ordering these, but I'm glad I did. I ordered some carob baking chips. Um, I think in my last Azure haul video, I showed you that I order their powdered carob, and you could make um, hot chocolate with that. Um, the reason why I select carob is because it doesn't have any caffeine in it that stimulates your adrenal system. So it's kind of a healthy chocolate. And really, um, Azure's brand of the unsweetened carob baking chips are the only baking chips that I've ever had in my life that I actually like that have no sugar in them. And they taste great. Um, also, Azure Standard uses the entire carob fruit or plant. I'm not sure exactly how they harvest the carob, but they use the entire product. Um, so it has no bitter aftertaste. It is very good, you guys. Okay, and then the rest of what's in here is all cabbage. I'm going to be making some sauerkraut. So I ordered four heads of cabbage, and then of course they send you their sales flyer, okay? So we will go to the next box. 
If you don't know how to make sauerkraut, I've got a video for that on this channel. I will try to link all those videos down below, you guys. Um, if I can remember all of the ones I've told you about. <laughs> I will try my best. They are all here on the channel, though. Okay. And this is the last box. $1,000 kind of goes quickly these days, as everyone knows. Okay, so I ordered um, two uh, bags of three bunches of cilantro. I've ordered these in the past, and then I go ahead and take a pair of scissors and chop them up the way I would like to in small little pieces and put them in a um, ice cube tray into the freezer, and then you have a thawed out, you have cilantro ready to go for any of your Mexican meals whenever you need it. So I went ahead and I bought two, two bags. They come in three bunches each. So six bunches total of cilantro. I talk about this every month, but here we go again. <laughs> I love Azure Standard's raw cheese. Um, this is a Grazier's brand. This is regular cheddar, uh, medium cheddar. Um, so I bought, I think two of these. No, I only bought one. I bought one cheddar. I bought one of their Monterey Jack. This is such good cheese. Oh, it's like eating macaroni and cheese, but it's raw and good for you. So there's another five pound block. These come in smaller blocks. Don't get overwhelmed. I've just stocked up this month, okay? Um, I ordered some virgin expeller pressed coconut oil to use, um, internally for some things that we have going on with our family. So, um, anyway, the difference between this and the gallon of coconut oil that I typically buy is this actually tastes like coconut oil and has a lot of the medicinal properties of coconut oil, um, in it to help with fungus problems or yeast problems within the body and a long list of other things. You want to make sure you buy the, um, virgin expeller pressed coconut oil for that use. For cooking, you can use the other stuff, which is the refined coconut oil that they sell in a gallon jar for like $20. Can, I try this? Um, can you just wait until we do it later? Um, the next thing I got back on the raw cheese wagon here is Grazier's is one of our favorites. We order this every month. If you guys have watched my other hauls, you know I order this every month. It's one of my husband's favorites. It is raw jalapeno jack grazers cheese in a five pound block. You can get it in a smaller block, but this tastes like jalapeno poppers with no breading. It is so good. And it's raw cheese, so it's healthy for you. So that's a five pound block of that. I stocked up on cheese this month, you guys. <laughs> uh, the next thing in the bag is one pound of garlic. They do sell garlic. And I've only had one time where like one of the bulbs is a little bit squishy. Usually they are nice and firm and fresh. Totally worth um, adding garlic to your order. The next thing on the list, I did not order an entire case of butter even though I wanted to. They were out. So I ordered a smaller amount of our favorite butter from Azure Standard, which is Romano. It's organic butter, but it's also grass-fed like 98% of the year. I believe it's over on the West Coast, and the cows are out on green grass for most of the year. So this is a very good, healthy choice. If you can buy it by the case, if it's in stock, that takes the price down below $6 a pound for organic, technically grass-fed um, butter. So really good, okay? Okay, the next thing that's kind of scrambled in here are um, the small cans of organic mild green chilies. I like these to use as a Mexican food. I usually grow my own um, green chilies and roast them and can them, but I'm all out, so I decided to go ahead and get some. They were out of stock last month, and so I decided to get a few jars to have on hand. More butter. Um, and then I got some... Azure Clean Whistlin' Automatic Dishwash Soap. This is the powder. Um, it works really good, you guys. Uh, I haven't had any problems with it, and it's a really good deal. I think this big eight-pound jug is around $20, so it's not that expensive. And it's clean. It's, not, it's free of everything that you would worry about. Just another, um, just another, can I just finish? <laughs> This video has been really, really challenging. If you guys don't watch this channel, I have five kids. And between the cold and being frozen to death, um, people not picking up their orders, orders coming damaged, things missing, 
and now our stuff is at our box being damaged. It's been kind of a wild ride. It wasn't the best month for Azure. Usually their quality is way better than this. But anyway, so she was just pointing out to me that several of our butters have like little dips taking out of the wrapping. Not a big deal. It can go right into the into the freezer, babe. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> anyway, we always have interruptions if you haven't ever watched this channel. So there we go. Um, okay, mild green chili is another can of it. See, this, this can was also smashed. Still good in it, but something happened in this month's Azure delivery. Another one. Okay, so here we go. Uh, the next product I purchased and stocked up on was Worcestershire sauce. Worcestershire, however you pronounce it. <laughs> I got two of these. Um, I got this one. Why did I get this one? There's something special about it. Um, it still has soybeans in it, but it doesn't have MSG, I think was what it was. It doesn't have. Um, so it's like a healthier version for our family. We don't use it a ton, but when you're making a barbecue sauce, it sure makes a difference. And if you need a sugar-free barbecue sauce recipe, I have one here on the channel. I will try and link it down below. Um, all it has is honey in it for sweetener. Okay? The other thing that I don't typically buy um, is this brand. It's Sierra Nevada brand of cream cheese. This is a two and a half pound roll. Um, usually I buy Nancy's cream cheese, but they were all out this month, so I went for this pound roll instead. And then I also bought some Dijon mustard. Um, and that's it, I think, unless we're missing something. I think that was my entire order. <laughs> so like I said, I order every month from Azure Standard. If you like these videos, if you um, also have any interest in the once a week cooking class every Tuesday night at 5.15, where we make a whole food nourishing meal for your family that's easy. If you need more uh, meal ideas, please check out my channel and subscribe. I would love that. Um, if you have anything to talk about, comment down below and let's start a conversation. Thanks so much for watching my videos, and I'll see you guys in the next one.